So one day I was looking for fun indoor play spaces where I could take Joseph to play and have play dates with his friends. And I found this place called Planet Bounce and they just have a ton of really large inflatables that the kids can bounce on and slide down. And so I took him there and he just loves it there so much. He's been wanting to go there all the time, and if we have a play date with one of his friends, they just want to stay there all day, and they'll just be running around, going up and down the inflatables, going down the slides, and they'll be running around for like four or five hours, and they'll get so sweaty, and then we ask them, do you guys need to take a break? Do you want some water? Do you want a snack or something? And they're like, no, we just want to keep going, and... It's just hilarious to see them like go, 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 and they don't want to stop. They just want to go up and down these inflatables and get on the slide, and they get all sweaty, and it's just, it's fun to watch. So, so he went to Planet Bounce this weekend with one of his friends, and so I will show you just of going down some of the slides. <laughs> So we love going to these inflatable slide indoor play spaces so much that we decided to run our own giant inflatable slide and since it was during a warmer month we were able to turn it into a water slide and it was so much fun and I'll show you guys the inflatable water slide here. So Joseph finally went down the big slide at the pool that we go to. I was so proud of him. I couldn't even believe it. He's been wanting to do it all summer. So I'll show you a video of him going down the slide here. So Joseph has had a huge growth spurt recently. He's actually grown three and a half inches in the last year. So I really needed to buy him some new clothes. So I went to Once Upon a Child. I love that store to buy clothes for kids. And I bought him a bunch of stuff for the summer. So I'll show you guys what I got. So I got four pairs of athletic shorts, three in black, and then one in navy blue. And then I got two t-shirts and two polo shirts. 
I want to show you guys how to make really easy pancakes that are healthy for your kids. I'm going to show you how to make the perfectly shaped pancakes. So first you want to get a pancake mix, follow the directions to make the batter. Then you're going to spray some ramekins or some oven safe round dishes with your favorite cooking oil spray. I'm using a ghee cooking oil spray because it tastes just like butter. Then you're going to place your pancake batter into the ramekins or the small round oven safe dishes. You're just going to use a spoon to spread the batter out so that it's evenly spread on the bottom of the ramekin. You can also make an egg in a ramekin as well. Once you crack the egg in the oven safe round dish, then you're just going to sprinkle it with salt and pepper and mix it up. The reason why I like to do it this way is because I don't have to worry about flipping the pancakes and having them mess up and batter get everywhere. The pancakes come out perfectly round in the perfect shape and so do the eggs. This is a pancake mix that I use and it's non-GMO and certified gluten free. The ingredients that you will need are eggs, melted butter, oil, and milk. I used mine with non-dairy milk. Once you're ready to put the ramekins with the pancake batter in the oven, you cook it at 300 degrees for 30 minutes. This is the non-dairy milk that I used. And this is the buttery spread that I used. It's ghee, so it's lactose and casein free. And then this is the organic maple syrup that I used. So here's a quick and easy breakfast that's great for kids and families. So I want to show you guys what I learned on the trapeze this week. So I've been really into making funny reels on Instagram. So I made one and it's when your mom's a dietitian and I'll show you here. Mommy, what are you doing? Chopping an onion. 